the missing. For the victims of the Grenfell Tower fire disaster. As if their bodies became lighter. Ten of those seated in the front pews of the church began to float. And then to lie as if on a bed. Then pass down the aisle as if on a conveyor belt of pure air. Slow as a funeral cortege past the congregants. Some sinking to their knees in prayer. One woman rocking back and forth muttered, What about me, Lord? Why not me? The risen streamed slowly, so slowly, out the gothic doors and up to the sky, finches darting deftly between them. Ten streets away, a husband tries to hold on to the feet of his floating wife. At times her force lifts him slightly off the ground, his grip slipping. He falls to his knees with just her high heel shoes in his hand. He shields and squints his eyes as she is backlit by the sun. A hundred people start floating from the window of a tower block. From far enough away, there could be black smoke from spreading flames. A father with his child on top of his shoulders, men in sand-colored galabeas, a woman with an Elvis quiff and vintage glasses, a deep indigo hijab flapping in the wind, all airborne amongst the cirrus clouds floating like hair. They begin to look like a separate city. Someone looking on can mistake them for new arrivals to Earth. They are the city of the missing. We now, the city of the stayed. Oh.